Hey everybody, this is A7X Fan Ben, and this is just a short review of the Louisiana. This is a four-masted American schooner from Pirates of the Revolution, and I think she is one of the most underrated ships in the game. A lot of my past miniature reviews talk about underrated ships, or kind of ships that I don't feel get the spotlight as much as they should or could. So this is another example of that. This one's got more cargo than mass, she's got solid speed, good cannons, the schooner ability of course, and the crew killing ability. Once per turn, when this ship hits an enemy ship, also eliminate one crew from that ship. So this is a great American hybrid, basically. Not one of their best, like the Providence, for example, but still a very capable ship. For crew suggestions, I would probably use a captain and a helmsman, um, and then maybe other crew, too. Maybe even just an oarsman to protect those two crew in case any get eliminated. But captain and helmsman will give you for 18 points. You'll still have three cargo spaces left for gold, SSS speed. And then, of course, you can move and shoot with those solid cannons. And I like how the 4S is at the stern on the final mast here on the Louisiana. You can see the physical model is a rather, I guess, an average-looking American ship, but nothing wrong with that. A little bit of a worn look on the sails, but not too old. Not, too, not really any battle damage that I can see. So, with the 4S at the back, you've got pretty solid firepower overall. And pretty decent striking range, so along, as long as you have Captain Ann Helmsman, your striking range is SSS. Then you can stern turn with the schooner at the end of a move action. And then the bow cannon is 3L. And with a schooner firing arc, you can pretty much shoot um, almost directly forward of the ship. And like a lot of other people, I don't use the kind of the old-fashioned schooner rules where the overlap blocks cannon fire. I don't like that rule. Um, for the earlier schooners, so you've got some really solid solid options with the ship Like I said one of the best uh, Candidates to be a hybrid for the Americans like a multi-purpose ship uh, You can fight and get gold you get steel gold because uh, the schooner keyword and her solid overall speed Can help her catch enemy gold runners, but then when things get ugly and need to fight an enemy gunship you've got some durability solid firepower and a nice offensive ability and of course, if you really wanted to load her up with a gunship, those 3L cannons are ripe for uh, equipment like fire shot, exploding shot, stuff like that. Maybe stink pot shot um, or grape shot to double up on the crew elimination. So this one is pretty sweet. I would rate her maybe uh, maybe a 7.5 out of 10. Um, there are better American four-masted schooners and like the Intrepid, the Hudson, and arguably the Saratoga and the Freedom and the Paul Revere. So. Of course, America has an amazing abundance with schooners, both three and four masters especially. They have a lot of great schooners in general. Um, so the Louisiana is one of my original ships actually too, from my original collection. So I pulled this one from a pack way back in 2005. And she's always kind of been a sentimental fight favorite of mine, but I feel for how good the ship is. She's quite, she's quite good overall. I don't think she gets enough, enough attention and love, so just wanted to make a quick little mini review of the ship. And in the description, I might have an affiliate link to her on eBay, uh, and or if Rain Tiger Games has her on there, maybe that one as well. So question of the day, what do you think of Louisiana? What would you rate her on a scale of 1 to 10 with 5 out of 10 or 5.5, whatever, being like an average ship? So I think 7.5 is fair. Might be a tiny bit optimistic, but I, it is a pretty solid ship overall. And of course, I am a little biased, but oh well. Thanks for watching, and I've got a ton of other Pirates content on the channel, so go feel free to check that out.